Welcome to the Advanced Quick Pro Guide for the Nikon D300S. This video will help you unlock the full potential of this amazing camera. We hope you'll enjoy learning more about it. This tutorial is meant to be a study tool in conjunction with, but not a replacement of, your camera's manual. You can watch it entirely in one sitting or by section according to your needs. Press the menu button at any time to return to a menu and feel free to use the skip forward or back buttons to get to the chapter or section you want. The topics covered will give you a good working knowledge of your camera's features and functions, however, not every configuration is covered. In addition to the video, there is an interactive camera tour designed to help you become more familiar with your camera and its functions. The Nikon D300S has a 12.3 megapixel CMOS image sensor. With an image sensor this large, you'll be able to make large quality prints when shooting at the camera's highest resolution. Nikon has included a self-cleaning function that removes dust from the image sensor. This is done with a small vibration that is felt when the camera is powered on or off. Let's begin with a quick overview of the major parts of a digital SLR camera. If you've already watched this portion of the video in the Basics DVD, go ahead and skip to the next chapter. The first item is the lens. The lens magnifies and focuses an image. It also controls how much or how little light will enter the camera. The second element is the shutter. The shutter assembly reflects the image into the viewfinder so you can see it. When the shutter button is pressed, the shutter opens for a very precise period of time in order to expose the image sensor to the focused image. The third component is the image sensor. The image sensor is a silicon chip that, like film in older cameras, is exposed to an image and precisely records that image so it can be converted into a digital file for storage on a memory card. The final item is the memory card. The memory card is used to store your images as digital files. Different cameras use different types of memory cards. Standard memory card formats include SD, memory stick, compact flash, and XD. Your camera uses Type 1 compact flash and SD memory cards. The memory card serves the same purpose as film in older cameras. It stores the image. Memory cards are intended to be reused and should be formatted before use to ensure they operate correctly. You can permanently store your images on memory cards, but it is usually better and more cost effective to back up your images on a computer hard drive or burn them to a CD or DVD. Many professional photographers make sure their images are backed up at least two times on different storage devices. Image files will vary in size depending on the resolution and quality settings you use on your camera. Digital images are made up of tiny pixels. A megapixel is equal to one million pixels. The higher the number of megapixels, the higher the quality of the picture. For example, images from cameras with 6 megapixels can make high quality prints of 11 by 14 or larger, and images from a camera with 12 megapixels can make prints as much as 20 by 24 or larger. 